Already day one was a huge success. Um, we've been having loads of great feedback. Um, everybody seems happy, uh, if, whether it's with the talks or the food or the venue. Um, just everybody seems to really be enjoying it and getting a lot out of it. Uh, sponsors are happy as well. Um, we've got a great space for them this year, so um, that's been really fun to see this space come alive. You know, as we change venues every year, it's always a new experience and um, sometimes some surprises. So it's been all all good this year on that uh, on that front. Uh, today, in particular, um, we've got a little bit more heat than we did yesterday. Yesterday was a little bit cooler. Uh, that's kind of becoming a thing with WordCamp Europe is the hot weather, but uh, I think it's going well. Um, uh, it was a little calmer this morning. I think people might have partied a little bit too hard last night or something. Uh, but uh, we've got a nice big crowd again this afternoon. Uh, yeah, the talks have been excellent. Well, you know, as an organizer, the one downside is that we don't get the opportunity to see a lot of the talks. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, I know we've had some great names up there. Uh, the two I did get to see uh, in their entirety uh, was John Maida, uh, who was fantastic, and then Andrew Nason, who kicked us off this morning. Um, always great speakers, and a pleasure to have them here, of course. Um, and, again, you know, I wish I could tell you more from personal experience, but everybody's just been saying that they've had a good experience um, and that the content has been really high quality and interesting. Uh, so I'm going to take their word for it. Well, uh, before we talk about the party, I'll say that Paolo and I are going to be doing some closing remarks after our final talk this afternoon where we're going to be announcing the location for next year's WordCamp Europe. So you're going to have to hold out for that. And then, yeah, tonight we have the after party going on in a, an amazing venue uh, called the Pavillon d'Armanonville, uh, which is, uh, we're on the north side of Paris. It's on the west side of Paris. It's a beautiful place. Um, we have got it all to ourselves overlooking a beautiful little lake um, and so we hope that a lot of people come out we're gonna have food trucks so people can eat there they don't have to worry about eating before they come uh, and yeah we're gonna celebrate all the great work we've all done and this great experience that we've all had together so it should be fun